Hey guys, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to be doing a bit of a throwback vlog. Um, this goes back to September, a couple weeks after my birthday, so I guess it's kind of a birthday vlog, but not really. We're just hanging out and we're going to visit some people and just kind of going about our day and I'm taking you guys with us. So if you enjoy, please leave a big thumbs up down below. And if you guys want to continue to see my content, please smash that subscribe button and let's get into this video. crap about me. <laughs> <laughs> that little struggle like, yeah, I am. So, mom was giving me trouble because I haven't recorded in a while. Attempt two. It does smell a little fishy right now. Salty, fishy. Hey, that was my butt, ma'am. Oh, yeah, we're gonna get run over. Who are we fighting? A runner or a biker? There's a motorcycle on the blue, it looks like. It's we are going, is it? Yes. <laughs> we're walking around and exploring again. And we're gonna go visit our friend Elva at the other side of basically the whole city. Uh, what are those beaches called that Elva's at? Cerritos Playas or something? Playas Cerritos? Sure. Yeah. Okay. Playas. Okay. Near all of those. And. Womania. <laughs> they always interrupt my filming. You just embrace it, but you can't hear me. I'm not using a mic because it doesn't work without the dongle. Ooh, look, people got tossed. That's always fun. So we're gonna go visit her. I'm probably gonna shop a little bit. And then we're gonna go get sushi for a late birthday celebration thing for me. After half an hour. No, I didn't. I was asking. After about half an hour on the bus, we are now back at the old beach we used to come to. So, <laughs> <laughs> this is our friend Elva. Our first like week here, we came and visited her little shop, and we've come back a couple times. And she's our friend, and mm -hmm. we enjoy seeing her. And I got a bunch of stuff from her. So, empty bus. Now we're crossing the road, and we shopped with her. Bought a rug, a necklace. Some bracelets and a backpack spoon rest. oh and a spoon rest for mom and we just kind of visited with her and saw how she was doing we've been wanting to come visit her for a while but we haven't been able to make the trip all the way out here because it's on the opposite side of the city from where we live now but we took the time and came saw her and she remembered us which was sweet so that was fun she gave, you a birthday present. She gave me a birthday present which is this red one and now now we're going to get sushi no, sideways. Oh, you it. I spilled everything. No, sideways, sir. Wow. YouTube. <laughs> so we just finished dinner and now we're fighting mosquitoes that are absolutely demolishing us and waiting for a bus to get back home. Before we go home, we're probably gonna grab dessert because today is just our late celebration of my birthday. So we're hanging out and everyone else is partying. It's currently two weeks after my birthday, I think. And it is Mexico, Mexico's independence weekend. So there's a ton of Mexican nationals, but also Mexican tourists here in Mazatlan partying it up for the weekend. Hey guys, Alexa from Future here. Um, funny story, as you just heard in this clip right here, um, I'm hoping that we don't get absolutely demolished by these mosquitoes. Ironically, a few days after this was filmed, I came down with dengue. So obviously the mosquitoes got me. Um, it is what it is. I didn't die. I'm still sitting here talking to you right now. I feel fine and um, I had a very, I would say not, it was like a very minor case. It was not severe whatsoever. I know a lot of people can have it really badly. And praise God, I was not. I was taken care of and it wasn't too terrible. Um, I'm just gonna explain a little bit of what happened just so you guys have an understanding. Um, I believe it was the Monday after this was filmed, which this was on a Saturday. I woke up at three o'clock. Well, I was up 
on and off all night. I really didn't sleep well. And then at three o'clock I was shaking pretty badly and I was feeling really nauseous and my temperature was like back and forth. I was feeling pretty awful. So I got up and went to go get some water. At six o'clock I went back out to get more water. And at this point my dad had woken up for the day and was like, what's wrong with you? Why are you up at six o'clock? Cause your girl does not get up at six o'clock ever. That's just, I'm not a morning person. So anyway, that's not the point. <laughs> um, so then he was like, well, what's the matter? And I explained how I was feeling and he's like, okay, well, let's check your temperature. So we checked my temperature and I have a low grade fever at this point. So he gives me some meds and then um, I got nauseous after that and we know what happens with that. And then um, after that, I went and laid back down for as long as I could sleep. And I was feeling really nauseous, really wasn't sleeping. I was rolling around the whole time. I was she came to check on me and then um, for the next like four or five days, I was still sick. I had fever on and off. I was shaking on and off with the fever. Um, I had a really bad headache. I had some body aches and the nausea was my main thing. So I really didn't have an appetite. So I was really just drinking water and different electrolyte fluids and like just trying to stay hydrated, but I couldn't eat because every time I ate, I just felt like I was gonna hurl. So that was basically how my experience was. It was just me feeling awful, laying in bed, resting. And then um, I wouldn't say that I had any of the severe symptoms that are hospital worthy. I was fine. It was kind of like just the flu. Like, that was my experience with dengue. I just wanted to let y'all know that real quick. So now let's get back into the video. It's coming to save us. <laughs> <laughs> okay, dude left. Now I'm sitting down. We're in the back of the bus. We've never been in the back of the bus before. So, the bus that we got on wasn't going to the tower. It turned off of the Malacone way earlier than we were expecting. So we had to hop off pretty quickly. And now we're getting a Didi back home. And then we're gonna go back out with the dogs and go look at the beach and how crazy it is for the weekend and then get some dessert, so. guys that's all i have for today's video so thank you so much for watching i hope that you enjoyed if you did please leave a big thumbs up down below um comment what your favorite part of this video was and i will see y'all next week